the website bubble.us starts off with going through with the brainstorming button just here. It takes you onto a window where you can start to mind map straight away. So for example here I'm going to just click and add some text. So I will just put in a uh, subject just here. Now moving it around the perimeter I can see that there's an enter and a tab. When I click on to the enter, it's made a uh, sub piece here where it's connected to the art and design. So I'm just going to put in here, for example, sake, year seven, and enter once again, and just put in another part just here. Now, if I click back to art and design, I can then see that tab and enter have come up again. So at this point I can click on to tab and this clicks and creates another box and section here. But if I don't want it, I'll just simply click on the cross just there and it gets rid of it. In here, if I want to make another section, I want to just click on enter again. And there's my year seven and obviously I can make that my year eight. So after that I'm just adding a bit more here and you get a general idea of this mind map which could expand quite easily across the page. Now to be able to export it I do the following. There's a menu button here at the bottom right and you can go towards where it says export and by clicking on to export it comes up here where you can export it as an image and JPEG just basically is an image format which is a lot like what you see on the internet so I'm just going to press OK and you can see that it's uh, saving my file with my image ready to go. So now that I've saved it onto the desktop, I can just go into something like PowerPoint and insert picture from the desktop and there's the image that I've got. And now I can use it in the presentation.